1.15 a.m. Wednesday, September 12th. Crisis counselors are called to Gander Academy. The plane people, they're exhausted, but they don't want to sleep. And we're standing there ready with all that food, but that's not what they wanted. They wanted phones. 1.45 a.m. Six phones are put on tables for the plane people to use, free of charge, lined up alongside the road by the new tail building. An hour later, they set up 20 more phones. An hour after that, there's 75 phones and computers with internet, all being used round the clock. Hello? Yes, it's me. Dad, I'm okay. It's okay. I'm calling from Canada. Safe and sound on the ground here in Iceland. No, Newfoundland. Yeah, we, we just, just saw, saw the news. news. Have you heard? yet from Kev. Or Selena. Go, Micah. And Lauren. My parents. My aunt. It's time. No, I'm fine. Where's David? Oh, thank God. Hello, it's Nick Marson. My plane's been diverted. Can you pass on to someone at head office that I'm fine? No, no. I just thought someone should know. 3.45 a.m. Overnight, the community's population has gone from approximately 9,000 to 16,000. I'm sure barely any of us have slept tonight. We're hopeful that our visitors will be back in the air come morning. I woke up from a dream, which I can't quite remember, but there was this music in it that I had heard somewhere before. I woke up from a dream that we were stuck in some backwater Canadian town and that my air mattress deflated. I woke up to the smell of freshly baked bread. 4 a.m. in Newfoundland is breakfast time in Germany, and we got a lot of passengers here from Frankfurt, so breakfast starts at 4 a.m. and we start scrambling eggs. Poached eggs, scrambled eggs, omelets. Fried bologna. Something called Towtons. I saw a casserole dish. I don't think I could lift. <laughs> they made enough food to feed 7,000 people. It's like they never slept. There's this one man from the Middle East. Well, we don't really know. Hasn't said a word to a soul, and some of the other passengers are a little bit wary of him. So it's a little odd to find him poking around the kitchen. Oh, hello. Hello, can I help you with something? Uh, yes, I would like to be of assistance with the food. Oh, no, that's not no, necessarily. I... You go out there and sit down. We've been going all night, but we can't stop. I splash some cold water on my face and just keep going. We've got 7,000 scared and angry people who don't want to be here. And they're about to wake up. 